Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Casper's Eye. How the devil are you? Good. Today we're looking at a little channel called Fearsome Top 5. Make sure you go over the channel, subscribe, and do the thing, okay? Because this channel, as you know, is bloody epic. It's short but sweet. That's what she said. <laughs> Without further ado, to our daily day, let's do this. There may be trouble ahead. Do -do 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 -do. Shh. Go on, Fearsome Top 5. Top Welcome five. to Fearsome Top 5. Today we'll be taking a look at 5 scary ghost videos that may just fill you with fear. Fill you with fear. Number 1. Number 1. Staring down a dark hallway sometimes plays tricks on your eyes, making you believe that you see someone staring back from the darkness. Well, in a terrifying video that I haven't seen in years, something was definitely staring back from a dark hallway. Posted 14 years ago on the Guy Terry YouTube channel, 14 this years video ago. has been frightening viewers for years. 14 years ago? Let's see if we've seen it before. Let's go. Simply titled, Ghost Girl Crying. No other details were given. Did you hear that? This video quality for 14 years ago is better than a lot of current videos now. Like, what the F is that all about? <laughs> He's got some alien technology. Oh, mate. Oh, fucking hell with the music and everything, mate. Look at you, a blob. Okay. Where is it? Are we focusing? Oh, it's gonna be stood there now, isn't it? Oh, fucking, this is freaky as shit. Oh! Are you f mate, what the fuck? As a man opens a door to a hallway, a dark figure- Oh my shit, a brick, mate! ...here can be seen crouched in the corner. And as he goes back to take a second look, this terrifying figure is now eerily standing and staring directly back at him. It's like fucking Chucky! Look at you! Chucky! Chills cover my body the first time I ever watched this video. And regardless of whether this video is real or fake, there's no denying that this is horrifying. Yeah. Number two. Number two. A girl named Ashlyn runs a TikTok account where you can find adorable videos of horses, dogs, and cats. Horses? I don't know about adorable, mate. But she recently posted a video of something that's not so adorable. About 10 years ago, Ashlyn and her dad took a trip to Savannah, Georgia. And for memory's sake, Ashlyn took lots of photos on this trip with her cheap digital camera. But it wasn't until recently, 10 years later, that she noticed something bizarre in one of the photos. Okay, so this is from mine and my dad's trip to Savannah. And I took this picture of something up in the rafters of this building that we were looking at. See? That? You, you can see it clear as fucking day. Um, well, I don't know about clear as fucking day, mate, but I can see it, yeah. And it looks like it's like crouching down behind it. But then... In the next photo, motherfucker's gone. There's nothing there. What? But there's an orb. Oh, so, shit. I have reason to believe that I caught. I don't, I don't want to erase it. Oh, sh. <laughs> Imagine if she just erased it. <laughs> that on my little janky ass camera. Zoom from in years maximum. Ago, that I caught some But we will just fucking keep it there, mate. Stop, like, okay, I'm gonna be like, looking in this picture now, and, and here we go, and z look at this picture, and uh, da, 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 just keep it fucking still. Creepy ass shit in this little warehouse in Savannah, Georgia, because, like, that it's, it's not there now, I but the orb is. But it's there. Mate, my eyes are like fucking pinball everywhere, man. I can't just zoom in on it and keep it fucking still, please, love. No. Up in the rafters of a dark building, Ashlyn managed to catch what looks like something lurking in the shadows. Uh, why have I got like a clown in my head? It's like it feels. It's like a clown. 
I don't know why I've got a clown in my head, all right? But that's what it appears like, like a clown. It's hard to tell what this figure is or what it could possibly be. But strangely enough, in the second photo that was taken moments later, this figure is now gone and an orb can be seen floating nearby. Ashlyn clearly has no idea what this could be, but if you think you figured it out, please put it in a comment below. Oh. Number three. Number a three. woman named Sierra Rose set out on an exploration with her boyfriend and best friend Marie. The group's Marie. <laughs> set their sights on venturing inside the infamously haunted Letchworth Village Asylum. That was built on a graveyard. <laughs> Located in Rockland County, New York, this now condemned building once held mentally ill patients that were often mistreated and neglected by the staff, oh. which likely left a negative energy throughout this asylum. As the group approached the building, they could feel the energy around them, as well as an overwhelming feeling of sadness. But once they entered the building, that's when things got tr what, what are these, man? Are these bathtubs, like, laid up? Do you have, like, it's a, it's a, it's a four-room, it's a four-bathroom room bath place are these baths can hell truly terrifying maximum privacy please can you hear that I'm hearing children. Be breathing all this stuff. Okay, I'm kind of a p I don't know how far and I want to go. Mm -hmm. I'm kind of a p I don't know how far and I want to go. Oh, I was like, what the f is that? Just ramble it, come on! <laughs> it's a person. Oh, there is oh, another. I mean, that means we have to go out. There's loads of people down there, mate. There's loads of people down there. There's people coming out. Oh my god. What? Doctor smoking weed. <laughs> What's a doctor smoking weed? What is about to happen, mate? Because this is freaking me I'm out freaking now. Out. Yeah, me too, love. Oh, shit, Walk mate. That was a shadow bastard. Finally walking through the building, Sierra managed to catch a faint shadow walking across... What the fuck is that? ...across the hall. This eerie shadow moves from left to right and disappears directly into a wall. And as Sierra turns back around, it almost appears that the shadow is now peeking out at them. Sierra did not see this figure at the time, but this video is proof that something was definitely there. Number four. I would, I would move the screen, but you, it, it, you don't, it, you're not missing much. It, it, what the fuck is that, man? That was weird. Because the people were down there originally, mate. The camera picked it up, so it's not like the camera issues. That was a genuine bloody shallow bastard. Or number four. Over on the haunted Wesley Manor TikTok account, a man named John documents the paranormal things he sees in this old building, and he's grown quite the following of people that are eager to see what he's able to catch next. According to John, he firmly believes that the spirit of a child is lurking in the basement. Imagine seeing a child like that. Look, let's go back, right? Let's go back. Look at you. Imagine seeing a child like that with black bastard eyes, huh? Hey, mate, you need to get some vitamin C or something. And in his most recent video, he may have just caught proof of this ghostly child. All right, I'm going to take a couple of videos in here because there's been a lot of activity as of late. A lot of giggling, a lot of laughing. I definitely hear things. God, I hate that whole way. Uh, I saw like a hand or like something. Things were rearranged a bit in here too. As John points his what? camera around the basement, he unknowingly caught something peeking what? around the corner. 
this figure quickly ducks back behind a wall, clearly trying to avoid being seen. The height of this figure would suggest that John may just be right about it being a child, but there's always the chance that it could be something else entirely. Oh, man. Number five. Okay. I think I've seen that one ages ago, I think. YouTube user Tommy TLAG posted a video that caused many people to sleep with the lights on. According to Tommy, a friend of his had been hearing strange noises in her bedroom at night for weeks. Eventually, she attempted to catch whatever was making these noises by setting up a camera to record overnight. She then sent the footage over to Tommy so he could edit the brightness and make it easier to see anything that may have been caught. Okay. But as Tommy took a look at the footage, he was creeped out to say the least. Oh god. Oh god. This is gonna be freaky shit, mate. Oh! What the fuck is that? Hey! What the fuck is that? It jumped onto the bed? Is she waking up? RUN! It's like a little fucking monkey child or something, mate. Look at you. What is it? It's a monkey child with long fucking bastard hair. Two minutes go by. Shit. No wonder she's bloody hearing stuff in her bedroom, mate. What is, what is this? Look at you. Look at you getting all cocky, huh? What the hell is going on here, mate? What the hell is going on here in this room? Wake up! She was awake the whole time and never felt a thing? That's what she said. <laughs> oh, fucking hell! While laying in bed, something looks to be trying to get her attention. A strange small creature attempts to jump on the bed next to her. Now I'm not sure whether to call this a ghost, a dog, or Dobby from Harry Potter. Fucking hell. Imagine waking up and seeing that bastard looking at you, mate. That is fucking massive beady eyes, hey? But feel free to let me know what you think this could be. That was weird as Thanks shit. Thanks for sticking around. And the merch at kespersite.com. Just Rambo it. Oh, <laughs> fearsome top five. That was a bloody good one, mate. I hope you liked it. And if you did like it, leave a little like and make sure you come back to see the next one. I'll see you in the next one. Take care. Bye-bye. <laughs>